Hey everyone, it is Selena Cloud here, and I would like to talk about a very, I'm not sure if it's an important topic, but yeah, I would like to introduce a topic. Let's talk about games. Okay, so before I went into Sims 2 and Sims 3 and everything else in the Sims community in general, to make Sims series and stuff like that, I used to play this game that also I kind of did series on before Sims, before I might even even met Diamond Crystal movies or any other person I met. Um, basically, I loved that game to death. It was basically called Free Realms, which sadly isn't around anymore. And lately, whenever I'm writing stuff or doing series like that, I kind of get reminded of the game. Basically, probably because of the Sims I make or the story I created. And I noticed online that people are trying to recreate free realms and stuff like that, but Sony keeps shutting them down before they even get a chance to be there. Or there is um, a missing piece in the program. But I kind of got myself thinking that maybe instead of like recreating the same thing over and over just to be shut down over and over, why don't we create something that can be even better than it was before like of course it's free runs we're gonna love it anyway we don't want anything to change like that kind of like YouTube how it's evolving in the wrong possible way no offense you too but you know like some people are recreating the same game or doing a new game based on the same concept of the game which I figured we could do at least even better than that. Like, create even better storyline. Because, like, before Free Realms actually went sunset, aka shut down, they really didn't finish the story of the um, Gloom thing. Which that actually got me really sad. Because, like, basically, after Sunset Valley, what happens next? And there were many worlds in the Free Realms game that hasn't been even unlocked yet. Which basically, that made me even more curious and more, you know, a little bit upset. It's kind of like a cliffhanger that shouldn't be there. Like, we don't know what happens next. And like, when I see other games like Wizard 101 and Pirate 101 and World of Warcraft continue their stories. I mean, Wizard 101 has at least three or two arcs now. Pirate 101 is creating a new arc as well. World of Warcraft might even create a new character storyline or something like that. But they keep advancing anyway. And Free Realms had to be the one to go sunset. And like, whenever I look at the games online that are there now, um, they're not that as fun. Even though Overwatch I totally want to buy because it got me interested. Yeah. Anyway. I, own, I thought of doing my own game for like quite a while. I have, like basically, I don't know anything about games. I'm gonna give you that. I mean, I played games. I even played Yandere Simulator. By the way, I love Yandere Dev with his updates and you know stuff like that. But like Yandere Dev, he gets help from other people, other voice actors, especially ones that are professional like. He gets help from other animators, he gets things like that. And most importantly, he does it, most of it on his own. He does the animations on his own. He does basically anything you can use. You have to use the resources around you, which is not that money online if you're doing this manually without school help. Or maybe he did use school help. We don't know. We, most of us don't even really know him. Besides the fact that he keeps showing up their videos every a couple of weeks or maybe even months. Though I can still wait. So back to my video game idea. I mean the most good I could do is create a storyline and stuff like that. And I don't know any programs that are possibly like Free Realms to do it. I don't know anybody that could basically just help me with the idea without just selling the idea and taking all the credit for it. And I don't want that to happen. 
like for me to just do a story for other kids to play with and then basically someone just buying the idea taking it and mixing it up a bit so that most of the stuff that I put in there that would be fair wouldn't be fair I mean of course some of the games is going to have to do violence like you know using your real money to get them but it's not that much where you have to be required to be cut back I mean, I know, I know it's in the game for your own, such so basically, you own, if you're a guest, you have to level up to um, level 5 and that's it. You basically stop there, you have to get the membership and everything else. And, yeah, my mom really hated giving me the memberships that last, yeah, they maybe last a long time, but let, let's be straight here. My mom really hates renewing those, because... She thinks they cost a lot of money. And of course I'm gonna put memberships in them. But maybe not as high price, maybe about twenty or ten dollars to get memberships that you can renew audio audio. So basically when a new month goes in, if the card can't pay it then it will stop but if it can it will renew itself over and over the parent kid also like change the way of the months go like they could pay every two months they could pay every month they could do anything to it but all that depends on how much you want the thing for okay so um I just need people that will probably help me or at least teach me the ways of doing gaming online and maybe some voice actors as well that will also help me so much because like I got inspired by the fact that a voice actor created Seduce Me, um, a gamer created Yandere Simulator. A lot of people creating these games that are really, really inspiring to a lot of people. And I want to be in like the filming industry when I grow up. Honestly, that probably might be the um, other thing that that I want to do. But it, it probably that it probably won't work out. We'll never know. I'll never know the future up to that point. But. My dad always says I need to find something else other than filming that I can do. And gaming might be the other thing that I would like to do. I don't know. I guess I'll see the future how it goes. But gaming might be my other thing besides writing and filming. So if you guys will comment and help me out, it will be really appreciated. And I'll thank you immensely. In the description, it will reveal the story plot that I have so far of one of the um, species that I put. I'm not giving you the other ones because, you know, a lot of people pretty much just take them and claim them as their own. Just now nah, have to start all over again. And that'll get me pissed. And so, that's all I have to say at this point. Goodbye and stay awesome.